shit like I'm Dennis. I started this shit, I'm a Before and after, huh? Yeah. Fuck that intake. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, K and N colder intake. All right. This I've seen that before where people cut it. Yeah, they cut true. it like right here for it to fit, huh? So it's yeah. not like fucking on it. Yeah. It's fine, bro. Cut what you gotta cut. So I thought, so I thought, so I thought I needed it. So I thought, so I thought, so I thought I needed it. Mm -hmm. Get the fuck out. <laughs> that dip doesn't fit in my truck. So what do you have to do? Take the take the inside. Another one? Yeah. Oh, you got it? Yeah. Oh, you got it? Cover too, huh? Hey, hey, all I gotta say. These will know I'm fast, bro. Bro, why the fuck would you put it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What happened? The extra one? I just gave it to you. I just gave it back to you. I was like, oh, there's a newer one. Oh, did you put it back? Oh, I think I left it in the box. I got a rep. Damn, that shit's dusty. You're a liar. I oh, I think I put it back in the box. I promise. I literally just, I was like, oh, there is another one. Oh, shit. I'm folding it in my pocket. It's right here. It's right here. Put it right here. Oh, no, no you need to clean this first. All the Takachis do that too. So I was gonna do that too. If you do it, I'll do it, bro. If you do it, I'll do it. No, it's just I had it right there. Hey. Oh, never mind. I was gonna put I it. I had it right there with the Texas Speed sticker, but remember I blew up my fucking. Texas Speed. Window. Hey, you have another one? The Texas Speed? I <laughs> just like, oh, yeah. put it on. I'm not even. <laughs> bro. 
I don't think I did a before and after of the sound of the ticking. What's it called? I got a before for sure. I remember recording that, but I'm gonna set it down right here and then turn it on so you guys can see how it sounds after the fix. I don't know if you can hear it from the inside, but I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do it. exhaust manifold uh, you can't even see it but if you see the silver in between the headers if you see the silver watch right here right before the headers so that was cracked over here which was making that ticking sound again so once we turned it on again to see if it would still tick this side was good but we found out this side has a leak as well but you can't see it through the top you have to go under it next weekend i'm gonna go debadge all of this stuff like the 1500 this the other side the other side as well i'm gonna take the 1500 and that i don't think the tailgate has any badges let me see yeah it doesn't i mean it has a sticker i gotta clean that off it used to have chevrolet or whatever on there but i gotta take that off like this this piece i'm gonna take off this oh I didn't even know it didn't have it, but anyways, I'm going to take off this, this, I'm going to debadge the truck next weekend. I'm going to go to Eric's because he had to do something right after I left. So we we're going to do both of them because I bought both of the manifolds, but we just did this side because we thought it was just this side. We found out both sides had an exhaust leak. So we're going to do the next side next weekend. And bro, I'm so dumb, dude. I went over there just for an exhaust leak, like just to fix that. And at AutoZone, I ended up buying a fucking a whole K&N cold air intake. I don't know why. Man. Actually, now nah, I needed to though because it's been a long time where I said I was gonna get one and I never did. But I was there and I was like, man, fuck it, I'ma just get it. And I got it. So I finally got it. We put it on. We had to cut some of this plastic off the fan so it could fit. But I've seen a lot of people do that because it didn't fit. But anyways, we had to cut that little thing off. Other than that, it's all good. Got that. So yeah, next weekend, see, we're gonna go to Eric's again so we can fix the other exhaust leak and then debadge the truck. Um, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do next Sunday. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna record that. See the befores and afters. But yeah, you see how right now I revved it and the ticking got like, it wasn't as loud as how it used to be. It sounded like a fucking machine gun. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Got done what I needed to. Next weekend, we'll do the other side and debadge the truck. But for now, Thank <laughs> you.